We are off to a good start. Wow. I mean, let's go. Hi, everybody. We are brunching it. There we go. We are brunching it. Who's excited for a little brunch? Hey, everybody. Um, Lisa and I uh, thought it would be really fun mm -hmm. um, to do uh, a quick little brunch. So we've been doing our dinner parties, as many of you know. Um, and now we thought it would be really fun to do a little brunch. I love that. It might or may not have been Mr. Tesher's idea. Um, so I do want to give some serious props. If you were just with us when we tried to go live, um, that was hilarious. So um, hopefully you're seeing this okay. I'm what gonna would walk you think over. If I grabbed a stand oh. and we just put it like right here. I love that. Okay, idea. you stand right here and smile. Okay. Oh Come my back. Okay. And look pretty. Come back. Oh. oh. <laughs> Having a stand. This will be great. Um, namaste six feet away. Uh, life is good t-shirt. Absolutely thought it was adorable. Good morning to everybody. We are kicking off an incredibly busy weekend. Um, so hopefully you'll be able to join us over on QVC. We have our shows at 2 a.m. Uh, tonight. So tonight into tomorrow. And then we have shows at 10 a.m. I'm sorry, 10, uh, 8 a.m. Noon and 10 p.m. We have another hour show. All right, Lisa's going to gingerly I mean, pull this out of the thing. Yeah, we all think this is so easy till you have to do it live. <laughs> Hold on, guys. Well, you can say hi to everybody okay. while you're doing it. Hi. <laughs> Hold on. I'm trying to do this. Oh. There we go. All right. All right. Now. Let's see. Not perfect. Lisa. How's that? Pro pull it back just a smidge. Like this way. Right? That's a great idea. Is that She's better? Brilliant. Yes. Should I tilt it down or up? Down a little bit if you could. That would be awesome. And uh, thanks for bearing with us with the technical, it just went back, it's fine. With the technical difficulties. Um, you both are hilarious, Gil. Well, we're off to a great start. It's not gonna tilt, tilt forward, Lisa. I mean, I like I'm trying. I think, I think we're good. Okay. What do you think, Mr. Tesher? Are we Tesher? okay over here on Instagram? He's is shaking his head. He's like, you rookies, you rookies. Like, dare I do it here or not? No, nah, leave it alone. Okay. Um, all right, so hey, everybody. Good Let's to go. see you guys. All right, so. What are we making? We're going to do avocado toast, and we're going to do avocado toast three ways. Yeah. So I thought that that would be um, really fun. I love so that idea. taking a simple twist on a recipe mm -hmm. um, that we know is super popular and kind of making it our own. So how's everybody up for that? Like that idea? Mm -hmm. Great. You want to toast the toast? I'm going to do that. Lisa's going to put the toast in. I'm going to toast the toast Ooh. that is on our beautiful glass Oh, have you platter. seen our glass platters? All of this is available at qvc.com, so you can go check those out. We just debuted them on August 2nd as we continue our Temptations Days, which is amazing. Um, hello. Oh, Melissa says she loves her skillet. We're going to actually be making bacon in our skillet. Um, Y'all are great. Good morning. Thanks, Megan. We had, a, you know, some um, technical difficulties. Uh, I don't know. We got to shoot videos. It has to go one way. You can uh, go on Facebook Live. It has to go another way. Like true story. Calgon, take me away. Is uh, that still a thing? Do you remember that commercial? I do. Like growing up. Yes. Weren't you always like, oh my gosh, yes. And you know what? My mom had a thing of Gina Tay on the back of her toilet seat, and it was like a puff thing, and you would just be like, poof, oh. and then. And then everything went everywhere. So Gina Tay, Gina was Tay. Like my favorite. And you could buy it at the drugstore. I don't know. You I could. just it was always in our Do you house. Know that? My grandmother used to use it. Oh my my mother used to use Gina it. Tay. And therefore I used to use it. Uh-huh. We'll talk about how I drank a whole bottle of perfume later. Um when I was little. That's a true story. Um anyway. It hi. Explains a lot. <laughs> Hey gang, good to see you. Oh, you got your dessert plates yesterday. What do you think of the glass? Ooh, hold on, hold on. Oh, Debbie's Emily. saying they're stunning. Jennifer, good morning, good morning. Hi, April, good to see you. April, April, April. Um, so nice to have you joining have us one. from Maryland. Oh, that's fine, falling yeah. for you. So Lisa actually has the Harvest glass plate. They match back to the platters. The Harvest, I believe, is completely sold out. I don't know about the plates, but just giving you guys a little heads Amazing, up. Amazing, right? All right, so you're toasting toast. Yeah, I'm toasting. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna start cutting some avocados. Lisa's so cute. She's like, so by the way, Lisa's not a huge fan of avocado. So full disclosure, me, I could bathe in it. I love it that much. Okay, it's a texture okay. thing for me. I totally get the texture thing. Totally. Not on an avocado, but I do get the texture thing. Are you okay if I start some bacon over here? Yeah, but did you want did you want me to show you how to do this? I do actually. Because Lisa's like, maybe you can actually teach me. Maybe so I could actually learn to like these. You yeah. actually slice the avocado, okay. give it a little twist. Seriously? Yes. And then you're gonna go, hi -ya! I like to do it like that always. <laughs> Don't worry, I promise. 
And then you actually just stab with a very sharp knife the uh, pit and you pull it out. If I plant that, will I grow an avocado? Um, my mother has done that numerous times and all I've ever seen, love you mom, is like some sprouts. I, I never see it actually work. Gail, she'll know. Gail, is that true? It's true. She has tried numerous times. Oh. So how many avocados do you think I should do? Um, I think we should do three. three? Okay. So here's three. the twist again, right? See how easy? And by the way, you have perfectly ripe avocados. Thank you. Can you not, it's like she's, what happened to Instagram? It's like she's driving with me. Hold on. And she's like got the phantom break going. It's true, true story. actually. I'm not sure what happened with Instagram. I'm not sure either. We're off to a banner start. I mean, I don't know. I know. Um, wait, Tara, can you answer something for me? Yes, of course. It says it's paused due to a poor connect. We're back. Um, <laughs> can I answer what for you? Um, how do you know when an avocado is ripe? Especially because I really don't ever buy them. Yeah. Because Joe and I so really So give like that them. a squeeze. Do you feel how it's a little soft? Yeah. It's not mushy. Yeah. But it's soft. Yeah. That's right. And then when's it too ripe? When it's just like, eh. yeah. And it's all, it starts to discolor and you can literally like push on it. Okay. So when you cut into it, it's like all brown. Okay. Yeah. You will not be happy. So when you bring them home from the store, do you yeah. put, just leave them out or put I them do. in your fridge? I leave them out. No, okay. no, no. I never put them in the fridge. Okay. See? Wow. Easy peasy. It's actually really easy. When we're not on camera, I don't know what's going on with Instagram, but when we're not on camera, go do an extreme close up again. Everybody I loved it. What happened, guys. Hi guys. Ooh, they got their buffetti. Buffetti, we should, oh, buffetti everything. Oh. By the way, have you guys seen our little mummy, little mummy, um, platter? By the way, hello to the over 500 of you who have jumped on to watch our um, food network. C keeps calling us, mm. but we're just going to stay here dedicated to all of you. I'm right here. Yeah. I'm on Instagram. <laughs> there you are. I honestly don't know, you guys. I know, it's, it's like, weird. It's weird. It just keeps it's going in and out. Facebook. Um, good morning. Ed, are you catching anything we're missing? Love the new salt and pepper. Hey, you know what we can do? <laughs> At the end of this? Of Cranky? She oh, she meant to write Cranky. I'm like, oh, that cranky. could be a new character. Oh, Cranky. Cranky. Um, how about if we do a garage tour at the very end? <laughs> whatever whatever you'd like, what my you friend. Think? I mean, it's a little scary. Whatever you'd like. Mm -hmm. um, so do you want me to... Actually, why don't we do it a couple ways? Why don't I mash one of the avocados okay. and make like a spread? Yeah. Why don't we slice one of the avocados and like fan it out? Okay. And then you want to start the bacon? Yeah. Now bacon is now a whole bacon, other story. Now bacon, she doesn't mind the texture, no. she doesn't mind the flavor, she doesn't mind any of it. All right, so I'm just gonna take my scooper, my double-edged tool in our old world in floral lace, <clears throat> mm -hmm. and I am just gonna go in and look at this lace, scoop out all the ingredient, all the inside of the avocado. So did you get pretty close, like to the edge? Yeah, you you won't take the skin off, so you get right in there. Okay. Yep. No issues. Let me move that little pull chop. I moved our skillet back here because I have too many things. You guys have this issue in your kitchen totally. where just too many things being plugged totally. in. And I'm afraid what's going to happen. After the champagne bottle yesterday, oh, I'm So a we were afraid. doing um, a Facebook Live with Mary D. Love her, by the way. We will be together for a one-hour show Wednesday. By the way, this is what I'm doing with my masher. Um, we will be together with her on Wednesday for a full hour at 9 a.m. Oh my so you're definitely going to want to tune in, check it out. That is for sure. All right. So let's talk about this. I mashed one of the avocado. Perfect. I'm going to give these a ditch these. And I then I can get something out of the garage. Here's a secret my mom taught me on how to slice an avocado. And so she goes in and just slices it while it's still in the skin. I should show Lisa this. And then she actually takes a spoon. And very gently, and you guys may already do this, she goes in and she loosens it and then it's already sliced. Look at this, you guys. Mom, you're brilliant. Okay, I mean, I know you know that. It's already sliced. So we sliced it right in, this, right in, the, um, in the skin. And uh, Lise, I just showed another little tip. You wanna see? What is it? You'll be very impressed. So instead of trying to peel it out of the skin and then slice it, Gail takes it and slices it inside. Gail's my mom. Okay. And then you very gently go in with a spoon and you kind of just scoop, scoop it out. around the edges and it's already sliced for you. Oh. So for you, who doesn't like the texture, Yeah. look, done, boom. Wow. Sliced. Okay. Okay? Yeah. 
I mean, who knew Lisa would be getting a tutorial on her least favorite thing to mm, eat? I'm gonna try to like it. You should like it. It's very healthy for you. I know. It's kind of it like how I feel about salmon. What do you need? I need now. Um, kind of like yeah. How about that? Sure. Um, it's kind of how I feel about um, salmon. I want to like it. I don't like it. You know it. how I like salmon? Tell you know, me. Um, Ed turned me on to this. It's like a wood plank. Oh. Like you know when they mm -hmm. do that, right? Yes. And it has like barbecue, yes. bourbon, something. <laughs> You just like the bourbon. Look at Lulu. Ed. I know. Under the table. On her blanket. Um, oh. Ed is here, by the way, <laughs> mainly because he wants the finished product of the avocado toast. Let me say hi. Y'all make great guacamole. Oh, love me some guacamole. So yeah. that is like one of my absolute fave things to do. All right, so I scooped out, I mashed, and in a little bit, I'm gonna spread with our double duty tools. Uh. Did you guys grow those tomatoes? We did. Plug, I, plug, when, plug, 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 plug. When I say we, I mean Joe. Joe. Because I am in no way a planter or a gardener. I'm not. But thank God I married one and I have a friend who's one. See? Who's that friend? Uh, you. Who? You. Who? You. By the way, I want to tell you guys something. Because Joe, I know you did too, right? You have what? all these cherry tomatoes. Uh, they're actually taking over the world. So Joe found a sauce, uh, a pasta sauce that's just made of cherry tomatoes. Uh, are you listening to this, honey? Good. Um, I want to go over to here. We wanted to make a Fradiablo. Oh, so, that's Joe's favorite. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. What yeah, happened? Uh -uh. Here, oh. More over here. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. More over here. Gotcha. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I'm like, what happened to my tomatoes? I want to give you a green and a yellow okay, for color. Okay, these we didn't grow. So those are just for color. These are for color. How's the toast doing? Uh, I don't know. But smells it smells like it might be burning. No, it's not. That. <laughs> <laughs> the toast is actually done. Uh, is it burnt? No. Okay. Uh, it's not. I'm going to show everybody in a minute. It is not burnt. Where do you want your cherries? Right there. Right there. Thank Tomatoes. You. Okay. Yep. Thank you. All right. The bacon is cooking. I smell do it. you smell it? Do you guys hear it? Uh, sizzle, sizzle. That skillet is in one of our oh, shows. Oh, yes, it is. 2 a.m. and 10 p.m. 2 a.m. and 10 p.m. If you guys it? have not checked out our electric skillet, you're going to want to. Yeah. Um, amazing. What do you want me to do? You want me to do the eggs or the crab? And Ooh. Open? Why don't you open the crab? Got it. Uh, best. Is it? Yeah, this is what I made my crab cakes from. R Lisa made the best crab cakes. We absolutely have to share that recipe. Like, I'm not kidding. Like, Ed said, hands down, the best crab cakes he ever had. Thank you. And they were not hard to make, and they I will agree. That's not true. She slaved over the stove all day. You know what you're supposed to tell people? Uh, I slaved they all day. They took forever. Uh-huh. Right. It's a true story. Uh, ooh, she got, oh, De Denise got the red skillet. Good morning, oh, everybody. Uh, Perry saying that they love our stuff. I see your oh, mom. Oh, there's mom. Don't you know the rule when you smell it, it's too late? Mom, uh, I wasn't gonna say anything, but uh, um, I did want to know how the toast was happening because okay. I could smell it. Now I, I'm gonna redeem myself right now. Here she comes. She won't touch the avocado. Does that look burnt? Oh, that actually looks like perfection. Okay. Oh, <laughs> um, give me this. You're not, uh, stop, no. You gotta go, okay, Gail? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean it that Okay, way. Gail? <laughs> Off. What can I tell you? <laughs> uh, yes, yes. Well, I don't know about you guys, but I am feeling some major allergies going on. Are you? By the way, what? just really quick, we made one of our dips. We made our caramelized onion dip, Ooh. half a cup of sour cream, half a cup of mayo. Um, we are nominated for a food choice award at QVC um, for our dip dip parade. Dip dip parade, dip dip parade. Uh -huh. So, Yes. If you love it and you want to vote for us, please go over to our Facebook page. We have it at the top. You can just click the link and you can vote for all of the different foods that QVC has uh, nominated for their Food Choice Awards. Mm. But I thought it'd be fun to use one of our spreads. I love on that. It. Did you see, um, I believe it was Jeffrey this morning who actually reposted, he did the cheddar cheesy bacon. I did not see that. Jeffrey, thank you. Oh, like, who do we have to welcome? Mary, Mary Vilk. Vil Gail. Mary Jo Hathaway. Is, and it's Gail. Her, and her, her name is, it's Gail, G-A-L-E. Yep. Is it Volkman? Volkman, we think. We think. Mary Jo, right? Hathaway. You tagged yes. someone and welcomed them to the new family. Mary jo, help us out. So we just wanted to say hi. We had that all prepared before we jumped on and started burning and things and doing things. True story. Um, ooh, Joy said she got the big deal. Joy, so you are in good company because they have a little thing called like a a pre-sell, right? So before it goes on air and they put it up and we share it with all of you, um, you guys have been apps. Oh, hello. 
It's what? like magic. Oh, you mean this? You guys have been absolutely loving it. So we recreated what we first started with, which was um, we started with rattan. We updated it into a beautiful banana leaf basket. You guys, just this basket alone is like, I'm obsessed with it. And then we, instead of giving you three teeny tiny size bakers, we gave you our most popular, which is our three quart. So it's perfect for maybe just you Pretty. or the two of you for an entree size or perfect for a side dish. Do you want to know something about this? What? So we I feel like we need this. some toast. At like noon yesterday. Yes. Right. Uh -huh. We have it in har We have it in some plaids, right? Harvest and holiday. Mm -hmm. Harvest. There's not even a lot left. Right. We haven't even presented it yet. True story. Just saying. We always like to give you guys the scoopy, right? Uh, Mary Jo, and you said her name correctly. Woohoo! Do do do. Do 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 do. That's actually awesome. Do do do. Oh. Toast. Um, Gail, perfectly toasted toast. Just saying. Gail I mean, knows. Lisa said. Yeah. Lisa said to let you know. Uh, All right. <laughs> so let's take one of our reversible tools again, and I'm going to start a spread in. What do you think? I love it. On one slice, I'm okay. going to take, we did our caramelized onion dip. Look at that. Love. Sour cream, mayo. <laughs> Get in my belly. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, by the way, we have Bellinis on standby. We have not opened them yet. For those of you who think we're just so silly, we must be drinking. Not yet. <laughs> not yet. Not yet. Um, so I'm gonna do a little caramelized onion. This then so good to I'm gonna spread a little of the avocado. Yeah. How awesome is this? Could uh, you, love. Could you ever put tofu on here? Um, yeah. Or was that weird? Ed, is that weird? Uh, with the avocado? No, no Ed, Ed would put tofu on anything. Nothing, okay. nothing is weird to him. All right, so we did a little um, French onion spread. Yeah. We did a little avocado. Yeah. Oh, do you have our spices, Lise? I do. I would love to put a little up for anything on here. Sure. We're oh, putting a few tomatoes on here. Up, uh, up, oh, oh, right here. And this, my friends, is going to be our first rendition of our avocado. You want to do the oh my gosh, Tara, That's so pretty. Does it look nice? Yeah. Okay. Where do we want to do it? Let's do it over the plate. Okay. Oh, you're so gentle. Me, I'm like, but Lama. Uh, okay. Okay, that actually looks, can you guys see this? So good. That's our first one. So that's what I would kind of call traditional, but wow. I tweaked it a little bit only because I had to put that caramelized onion dip on it. What do you think, Edward? Uh, How we doing? It, it looks as good as it smells. He's saying yeah. it looks as good as it smells. Again, he's smelling that toast. Okay. Uh, no, um, I'm smelling bacon. How about for the second one, yeah. we'll do the crab. While sure. you're still cooking the bacon. Love. Does that work? Um, so why don't we... What do you need? Why don't we actually put a little crab first. Okay. Oh, is this like light? Oh, this is like layer. We're going to layer. Like this. We are going to layer. Megan wants to know if she can call DoorDash and pick up from... Oh, DoorDash. Megan wants to pick up from DoorDash. I love How that. hilarious is that? Oh my gosh. Hey, we could open up a restaurant. Would you guys come if we <laughs> opened up a restaurant? Would again, again, the Food Network restaurants like we are busy well, what do we call it what should we call it yeah give help us. us if we were gonna open a restaurant oh boy what would we call our restaurant i can't even like i, I can't, can't even be I'm, witty right me neither. now i'm trying to think of something quirky and funny I know. and we can't take lucy and ethel because i'm pretty sure that's taken all right so look we did the crab meat we did the avocado oh. what else do you want to put on here the egg salad that's next, right? Oh, with the on bacon? top of there. With the bacon. How about the basil? I love How about that I do idea. a little chefinade of the basil? Another uh, trip trick my mom taught me is to go ahead and roll this. the basil oh. into like a little log. You guys probably already know this, so bear with me, right? And then what you do is you slice it and it makes long. Uh, blades of it, of the basil. It's called chefinade, right? Chefinade. So, chef <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow. Um, and right? so you get these long, like, curly cues. Isn't that fun? Love it. Love that. So when you want to sprinkle, oh, and then God. do you have a little so salt and pepper? I do. Let's do I a little. I don't think we need the salt, but let's do, oh. These pretty grinders. Those glass grinders. Love. They're right. on today, too. You want to do a little? Yeah. yeah. You can do the, I'm going to wash my hands real quick. Yeah, I got it. Because now we're going to get serious. This looks fabulous. And we're going to get into the bacon. Seriously. Look at this. 
Wow. You know what? I have to learn to like avocado. Yes, I agree with you. Mm. And That's we'll show you guys, we'll pull the camera off and we'll show you all yeah, three before we're for done. for sure. All right. Oh. Hello, bacon. Okay. You like this, huh? Uh, are you kidding? Mm -hmm. I okay. love it. All right. Okay. What's next? What is next? Well. So how about if we do a bacon and egg? Yes. So Ooh. have you guys seen MC's um, pull chop? This item, I'm so in love with it. Let's do two. Think we can do three and not jam it? Okay. Let's try. Sure, give it to me. <laughs> Look at her. She puts it over to the side. She's like, yeah, no, I'm going to okay. see you over here. Do you remember the last time I tried? Seriously. You got it. I got it. Okay. It's just. You it, can't. You got to do it on the counter. You got to do it on the counter. You have to. You're right. You see, I tried to do. There we go. MC. Mm. MC. Okay. So. Yeah. Oh, you really put that lid on okay. there. Jeez. Wow. Look how awesome that is. Um, I love this. Wait, Look, he shows it all the time. Like, you don't even have to put mayo in here. That's no. how awesome that is. So good. So I have a little extra avocado over here that I'm going to actually add back into the masher. Can I, I eat like some it. ingredients? Yes. No, we're very strict about our rules I here. I bacon so much that... So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take the excess avocado we okay. have. I'm going to take the excess basil that we have. Yeah. Because why wouldn't we? Let's mm -hmm. not waste anything. Okay. Lisa and I are big on not wasting any food ever. Mm -hmm. Ever. That is the truth. So let's go here. And we're going to do a little egg and bacon. Oh, you know what'll be fun? Let's actually add the egg in here. Oh, now she's getting smart. How can you do a cup of coffee? Me or Ed? You. Oh. Ed, Ed. Anybody. Absolutely. I never turn down a cup of coffee. Can I make you guys a cup of coffee? <laughs> My mom bought me this new Keurig machine. That's, That's so like sweet. That's fancy. It is fancy. Isn't it? It's very fancy. It's fancy. All right, I'm going to put a little more egg. You guys, this is awesome. Is I'm actually totally coffee? just making this up right now. Want a coffee? You sure? Which is, by the way, exactly how I cook most of the time. What time? Just making things up. Ed's always like, what did you do there? I'm like, I don't know. That's because you're your mom. That's what I, your mom Totally. Does. My mom does not measure or any of that fun stuff, what except flavor? for when she's doing recipes. What do you, oh, Cafe Bustelo. By That's the way, you guys, Love. if you've never had these K-Cups, Tara. Delicious. Cafe Bustelo, absolutely amazing. And they're, they sell coffee in the can, and it's amazing, too. So here's my scooper. So look what I did. I incorporated the egg that I pull chopped. And now I'm gonna smear that, right, honey? How'd I do? Smear, good. <laughs> I'm gonna smear yes. that on, and so that looks delicious. And now, you know what would be fun? What? Let's um, let's dump out this egg. Yeah. And let's pull chop the rest of this bacon. Oh. Tara. I'm all about like, did you? Oh yeah, here. I'm Wait. all about dicing and everything being like the Wait. same size and that's incorporating. Actually, that's a great idea. And I just want to make sure that you cook this okay. Mm, let me try it again. I'm not sure yet. Did you ever cook bacon? Hold on, I'm sure I'm still not sure. And then by the time you go to serve it, uh -huh. you're full. Like, you're full. You're full. And, and there's like a quarter of a pound of bacon left. That's mm -hmm. it. Because you ate three quarters. Mm -hmm. I do it every Sunday. Now, here's the best part. Tell me. I'm not sure I've ever seen MC pull chop bacon, so I don't know. Let's uh -oh. see what happens. MC, are you here? Oh. Is it working? It's working, and I'm going to show you something. Hold on. Oh, boy. I this thing is like, oh, what? look. I made bacon bits. Isn't that fun? So. I didn't know if I could do that. I just want to show you something. Instead of, like, buying these, seriously, mm -hmm. you can make fresh bacon. Yep. And get MC's pull chop. Yep. And make... And wow, that's all I'm gonna say. Wow, wow. that's a wow. So no sugar, right? In your coffee? No, not in mine. And you want Thank almond you. milk or coffee mate? Uh, coffee mate would be fine. Okay. Gosh, you're amazing. Thank you. Mm -hmm. She's a barista too. <laughs> what do you guys want? We She's are here. A barista. We're gonna open. We're gonna go to DoorDash. <laughs> Will you look at this? This it, might be the best one yet. I agree. I actually uh, agree. I'm obsessed. You got, did you show it to them or can you not? I'm going to grab that. I'm going to turn it turn around. Turn it around. Okay. Um, and I'm going to show you because okay. they look amazing. Yes. And then we're going to talk about this weekend. Yes. Love that. Um, thank you guys for spending the morning with us. I know. We are up to our eyeballs in product samples. I'm sure you guys know our homes are now um, our studios. Studios. Right? Mm hmm Yep. So, yeah. That's how we roll. That's how we roll. Hold on. I'm coming in. I'm coming in hot. I actually, grab the phone. Um, so no dog has barked. I know. What's up with that? I don't know. 
Oh, hi. Wait till Joe hi, right guys. Um, oh, Diane said she can't wait for tomorrow. I want the bacon, avocado, and egg one, right? I honestly did just kind of make that one up. Um, Hetty, tell my Facebook boyfriend, Mr. Ed, she says hi. All right, so here's okay. what we did. I'm going to turn them around. Look at this. So this was our very first one. And that was kind of what I would call our traditional. We used our, our caramelized onion spread. So one of our, oh, hello, Tara. One of our um, dip dip parades with a little sour cream and mayo. We put that on first. Then I mashed the avocado. We used our um, spice, our little um, up for anything. So if you haven't checked out our spices, you should absolutely check them out. They're amazing. Yep. Um, Michelle said she, we remind her of Lucy and Ethel. Did anybody name our restaurant yet? What I'm just it, curious. What is the restaurant name? Um, so amazing. Then we went to a little bit more of a spin where we used crab meat. We used avocado. And then I did a little chiffonade of the basil that Joe and Lisa are growing. And then, excuse me, I got so excited. I ate that bacon like so fast. Um, and then we actually just did a little salt and pepper. Yeah. And then lastly, yeah. I kind of just made a whole mixture of pulled egg, uh, avocado, and then I pulled chopped the bacon. <gasps> Tara, seriously. I can't, I'm actually, we're going to, we're, you're going to actually try that one live on camera. Well, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh my God. That's hilarious. Okay. Um, I would never ask you to. I'll make her do it in private. Okay, so the cherry tomatoes were homegrown. The basil was homegrown. And everything else we kind of just put together. So uh, uh, Rosalia said it should be T&L. Should be our, oh, Gil said our restaurants should be Gail's. Oh, Aww, that's, that's sweet. Nice. Well, that's very, very true. Uh, the T&L temp table. Oh, I love that, Mary Jo. Ed, you want to come in and say hi? I do. What's up with you? Let's go. What's up with the energy? Come on. The energy. Come crashing in. Hi, everybody. Say hey. How about we call it? How about we call it everyone's place? Oh, I love that. Yes, it is. Everyone's it's place. It's going to be all our place. Yeah. We're all going to share together. I wish, I wish everybody could smell. How good it smells? How good it smells. That might be the bacon. That it might is. be the bacon. Yeah. Crazy foodie gals. Yeah, it, it, <laughs> How fun is, is this? Uh, this? There is something about the aroma. Yeah. Uh, well, yep. Thank yep. you for sharing your mom. Oh, I love Hetty said we should co combine our mom's names. So Carol and Gales. Yeah. I love Wouldn't that, that be cute? Carol and Gales. I love that. Oh, everyone saying hi, Ed. Hi, everybody. That's actually a really sweet idea. Isn't that fun? Chris Rieger. Hey, I saw your new car. Congrats. Drive it in good health. Uh, Drive it in well, good health. Thank you, everybody. Yes, thank you. thank you for popping in. All right, you guys keep going. Uh, All right, so back to your home studio videos are priceless. <laughs> oh, Lisa said we're going to go out into the garage in a little bit. So I'm going to actually take a sip of coffee. I don't know why my nose is running so bad. Is everybody's allergies killing them today? Uh, Denise said nice hat, Ed. What is it, by the way? Is it just plain blue? Just plain, plain blue. Hmm. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Lisa's throwing things at me. I am. Um, so what do you guys think of our avocado three ways? We just thought it would be really fun to just do a cute little brunch I love that. and change it up a little bit. Instead of just doing one avocado toast, we did three. I love that. Just ordered the gray baker in the banana basket. Yes. Oh. Oh, yes, you, yes, does yes. Does anybody yes. have any questions that we can answer? Yeah. For let's, um, let's right? get real. Let's get down to pass the avocado toast. Yeah. Literally. Oh, you know, the other thing that Lisa was saying, like if you don't have avocado, because yeah. a lot of times they're not ripe or... You just don't want to be bothered. Of course, you can always use store-bought guacamole. So I thought that was a really good, um, what do you call those things? Like when you give a tip and it's a, a cheat, not a cheat. It's a tip and short, cut? it's not a shortcut. It's called a, a halfway homemade or something. I, I don't know. Does anybody know what she's asking for? Help. <laughs> There's an expression. Oh, <laughs> it just goes, <laughs> okay, and they're what, crazy. What is the um, You know the expression, right? <laughs> No, oh, cuckoo, oh, he cuckoo. said. Not cuckoo. So what are you doing today? Uh, 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 worst allergy season. Thank you, Annette. Wait, now? Gosh. And, and I always say to Lisa, those, um, what are the masks? The surgeon masks. Yeah. Like the, whatever that material is. Uh -huh. Makes my nose run like crazy. Oh, so yeah. I think I'm somewhat allergic to it. A hack. Chris Rieger, thank you. Oh, a, a kitchen, kitchen hack. hack. Thank you. Yeah. It's like you can get a kitchen cut. Oh, now all of a sudden hack. she knows. Now all of a sudden uh -huh. she knows. Yep, It was exactly. a hack. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh -huh. How do you spell cheat? How do you spell what? I think it's called cheating. It's cheating. called cheating. No, it's not cheating. It's helping. It's helping. It's a hack. It's like brilliant. Yes. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, what do you guys want to know? Yeah. 
Love the spin on the egg salad. Right. And we didn't need mayo. We didn't need any. Ragweed is starting. Ed is going to be a disaster. Oh, uh-oh. Cheat, cheat. I cheat, love you guys. Cheat. I like that. I love it. I love it. I love it. You guys are so much fun. So who's excited for our hour shows? Who's excited for a brand new item in In the Kitchen with David? We oh. may or may not have been sneaking and showing you um, my latest and greatest brain configuration. And it may come in gray. <laughs> oh, I love you. Um, Semi-homemade. I think it's trademarked <laughs> by Sandra oh, Lee. Yes, I think you're right, Hetty. You're absolutely mm -hmm. right. Um, where can I buy the night? Oh, the night. So this is old. These, do you guys remember these? These are from way back when, but it's like Lisa always says, they were the best, the best knives. So we actually are working um, with a manufacturer to um, possibly bring some of these pieces back. Yeah. So if you're interested in it, let us know because um, we always take your feedback and share it with the buying teams. Yeah. And uh, they want to know what do the Nistas want? What do you guys want? That's what they say to us. What do the Nistas and Nisters want? More yeah. More Ed, really? Is that what they want? It's probably Aww. actually true. I, I want you to see how hard at work Ed is. While Lisa and I are in here slaving away, <laughs> he, the man of the hour, is taking care of the cat and taking care of Lulu. Hi, Lou. It's not easy. Uh, it's not easy it's at all, is it? Easy. You look exhausted. I need props for this. You do need props for that. What are you doing, Lisa? I'm following you? Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. To that, oh, you ordered one too? <gasps> I don't know if you guys have seen, but in this whole quarantine, we have found a love affair with Jenga. Ed bought a five foot one. Now Lisa bought a five. Are we gonna have dueling Jenga games? Yes. Um, I love it. Yes, while we eat pizza. While we eat pizza. Did you guys um, ever play Jenga? I gotta tell you, the highest we've gotten so far is 14. Right, so I think it's 18 is how it starts. And then we've gone up 14 levels. It's amazing. Right. By the way, Lisa painted her fireplace and I'm totally obsessed. I mean, it's gorgeous. It needs some okay. help up on the mantle. It doesn't need help. No, it looks like, amazing. Just like, you know what I mean. Now, are we going in the garage? Do you want to? Do you do you wanna well, let's come say, on. let's say, do you guys want to go in the garage and see what Hold we have in for store for you? There is no judging <laughs> of my garage. Please. Well, because here's the deal. The Lasorts are super neat super organized until we have to descend here for the next 48 hours and literally run a studio, a kitchen, a warehouse. And so of course they're not gonna judge you. Okay. Okay. Plus there's some great sneak peeks out here, come on. Let's go, Lulu, you have to stay there. Ready? Gar Chris, garage time. We should actually make that a segment. Oh. Wouldn't that be fun? I Garage love time it. or basement time. Because when you guys come over to my basement, it's similar. Yeah, Mama, stay six feet away. Oh yeah. We are going to just pop our head in here and take care of everything in just a minute. I'm just checking on everybody. Oh, garage, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Megan said it is a no judgment zone. Is that true? It absolutely is okay. true. Okay. Absolutely. Right. Okay. Next. So let me turn this around. Let's start with the U-Haul that needed to come down to bring <laughs> all of this product, yes. which is unbelievable. Uh, yeah, we have to show this. Have you guys seen this? I can't even. So this is our chip and dip, our latest and greatest Buffetti chip and dip, where these are the little holders for your toothpicks. I can't, and the little crock. Remind me, is it 18 ounces? I think it's... It's 16 ounces, 16 ounces, 13 inch, and then you get the ghost and the little pumpkin on his little cart. Beep, beep. Are you kidding? Uh, beep, beep. What oh, are those shoot. things called, you know, where you push the thing he's on? Go cart. No. Push cart. I have no, oh, you Kitchen like, hack. <laughs> you guys, I don't know. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, have you guys seen our towels? We, look, we haven't even unpacked yet. I know, we are like, in the process. So oh. Yeah, so thanks and giving. Hold on. The... Eat, drink, and be merry. Here's the item number if you need it. Oh. <laughs> Lisa, that's so convenient of you. Isn't Thank it? you. Thank and you. And then, hold on. And uh, then, uh, oh, these linens. These are these in the show. Yeah, Have you guys it. seen these linens? Have you seen our harvest linens? Obsessed. Where this leaf picks up and you actually can put your flatware in there. And it comes with runners and And there's and a napkins, runner. Yeah, what else right? is under here? There's oh, there's the runner. the runner. Here's the runner where we actually took 
um, various looks of our pumpkins, our checkerboard. This runner, you guys, is so stunning. And we'll be in one, a scooter. Thank you. And we'll be one of our shows. Oh, remember these? Oh, the microfiber towels. Yeah, hold on. These are so These are fun. Cute. Yes. Ooh, it's hot out here. Uh, Ooh, it's hot. Yeah, this is going to be a short garage <laughs> run. Yeah. Uh, yeah, look how sweet these are. So these are our microfiber, super absorbent. So we have Harvest Blessing, Happy Fall, y'all. We have, oh, the Boo Fetty, Wicked Delicious. <laughs> and this makes me laugh. I'm here for the booze. Uh, you know, <laughs> booze, like boo. I'm here for the booze. Yep. And, love and then Sweater Weather. So we, we took actually these sayings and put them on the Harvest Plates that we've been showing you. We should show them the cooler. Uh, Would you like to see? That's what we have. We actually opened it up before and we were like, just close that. We'll get to it later. It's We've totally said, intimidating. Hashtag overwhelmed. Hashtag <laughs> overwhelmed is right. Um, but look at our stylist. Like, look at this beautiful cake, you guys, on our glass platters. Like, so many great things. Mm -hmm. What else can we sneak peek in here, Lisa? How about that dinnerware? Oh, how about that dinnerware? Right? Have you guys seen our 16 piece essential set? It's under $57. And we're debuting it in taupe. Is this the first time in gray too? Not, not, not in gray. gray. Okay, so in taupe. Um, and it's amazing. So you'll see that. And then this is not set yet for this show. It's not Maybe like, Wednesday. No. Oh, no, because it's still not in yet. You know what we're thinking? Seriously, like be very beginning. I love of that September. you keep moving your arm because I'm like this. Well, okay. I'm going to put it down. Now. What, what do you mean, purple okay. tunnel? There um, so there's our um, saute pan in one of our brand new colors, the cream. So really excited. And we're also going to be uh, debuting a teal as well. So we'll show you what the fridge looks like. Again, very intimidating. <laughs> uh, something we need to deal with later and not drink the oh, beer that's wait, in I'm there. Sorry, what's this? Oh, what's that? The last time I talked about our no bake Grammy cheesecakes. All right. We so go we got to go back inside because the uh, garage does not love our connection. Um, so how fun was this? Thank you guys for jumping on and uh, some sneak peeks. There's a box outside didn't that, um, I can't even tell you how exciting it is. We'll talk about it later, but it got delivered. We've been waiting for it while we were chatting and talking about avocado toast. Lou is very excited about the avocado toast. Um, the wavelength mugs actually, what, when is that lease? Right now. Right now? Yeah. Oh, uh -huh. thank you. I mean, just because you're here, the video actually doesn't go out till like 7 o'clock tonight. Oh, so do we want a sneak peek? Yeah, totally. So have you guys heard about our mug cakes? Um, we did a cheeky chocolate and we did a confetti, a classic confetti. And these are amazing. You literally follow the directions on the back, but you literally put a little water in, mm -hmm. mix it in your mug, put it in your microwave for like a minute and a half, and you have the most moist, delicious, ooey gooey base of a cake. And then you can decorate it however you want. Well, right now on temptations.com, you pick the color. Come with me. Yes. Come with me. You pick the color of your wavelength mug, either teal, red. Who has a house phone? Teal, red, white, or gray. Lisa and I always joke. Sometimes it rings and we're like, wait, what? She has that because she has an alarm system. But um, <laughs> there's your teal, your red, your white, or your gray. You get a set of two, whatever color you pick. And then you're going to receive eight desserts. We're gonna throw in eight of the cheeky chocolates and we're gonna include eight of the classic confetti, four, sorry, total of eight, back it up Tara, four of the classic confetti, four of the cheeky chocolate. So eight total desserts, two awesome mugs, under $20? 19, under, yeah, 19 and change. What? Go over to temptations.com and check that out. These honestly, We these haven't even sent out, is that mine? I love no, mine you're somewhere. I'm gray. I did yours in gray. I thought I was blonde. <laughs> Where is your blonde? I don't know. It's probably out in the garage. All right, gang. Well, this was really fun. Yep. Thank you for popping on with us. Oh, Lulu, you want to say? Want to say what's up? What's up? Oh, hi. Oh, Thank you. Here's our alarm system. Right yeah, here. really. No one's getting in. <laughs> Ed always jokes. We have a little uh, teacup poodle. Tux, he's the loudest one. He weighs six pounds. He said, canceling ADT. That dog is like <laughs> ferocious. Um, so anyway, okay, you guys, this was awesome. Can we do another Facebook Live later, like when we're setting up tonight? Why did you just say that? later? No. <laughs> I mean, Lisa I did not jam three words together in her excitement mm -hmm. at all, did you? Like, oh, what? Matthew said, I've been in the hospital since Thursday night. I'm oh. so sorry, Matthew. 
Uh, we will absolutely pray for you, 100%. And uh, keep us posted, okay? Yeah. And hopefully we made you smile a little bit because um, we're certainly very silly. So avocado toast, three ways. Traditional, crab meat, and just an egg and bacon that I kind of made up with in my brain. Okay, you guys. Uh, my American Eskimo barks with his tail wagging. Uh, so does ours, Teresa. Actually, you, you think he is going to bite you, but he's really just excited to see you. <laughs> um, okay, you guys, all kidding well, aside, thank you. Before oh, we go. Lisa, another, yeah. another what? Just before we go. Yes. We just have oh, a reminder. Show just a so reminder. this actually is now available. This is our big deal. It will only be at a certain price for a certain amount of time. You can go over and check it out on qvc.com. We did it in old world colors. We did it in floral lace colors. And we did it in a harvest plaid. And we did it in a holiday plaid. It's a throwback to the very first piece that I shared with all of you 18 years ago that came in rattan baskets, teeny tiny sizes. We yeah. upgraded the basket. We brought back a great shape, um, beautiful beading, borders, uh, braiding details, helper handles, everything that we've been evolving for the last 18 years now in our big deal. And it's under 28 bucks? That's correct. Under $28. Yep. What? For yep. hand painted stoneware. And you know what else? Yes. Because if you want to stay in the know and get the sneak peeks, go to temptations.com and share your email address with us. Oh, great And you'll get to know before everybody else when right. we're going to do these breakfast things. Like the wavelength? It's not even like really out there. Yes. So sneak peeky for you guys for checking in with us. Yes. So um, mwah to all of you. Matthew, be well. Good luck with the surgery. Oh, oh all the best to The all gang's all here. The gang's here. We're Lou. all here. Lou, look. <laughs> you, know, you, you, you all feel like our neighbors. Yeah. We're all neighbors. Come on here. over. We have avocado toast. We're yes. all neighbors. <laughs> well, all, all kidding aside, we actually all are neighbors in this in this little battle that we're all going through, but yeah. we are all going to come out of it all on the on the right side. We so. are absolutely better together. That's yes. right. So we love you guys. Thank, thank you. you. Thank for, you for being uh, part of our family. Yep. And thank you for spending some time with us this morning. We'll see you um, at 2 a.m. <laughs> Eastern time for a big one hour show. Uh, that Buffetti Chip and Dips in there, sneak peek. Yeah. Bye, guys. See ya.